McElroy. The Talon 2000 was built as a fusion machine for thermoplastic pipes. The machine has an innovative jaw function that allows it to pick up the pipes and load them into the machine without the use of other machines. The machine moves along the pipe via steel tracks and is controlled by a worker using a wireless remote control. There is a control that follows the terrain for better alignment of the pipe on the ground. The machine is easy to control with a touchscreen interface. This system is similar to the systems in other McIroy machines, allowing the workers comfortable and familiar. Parts of the system that need maintenance can be found remotely by technicians via troubleshooting in real time. There is a record kept of all the joint fusions to make sure that all the procedures are followed. The data is recorded by a built-in data logging feature and kept by the data logger vault on a secure server. Dynaset Dynaset designed a hydraulic recycling vacuum bucket, HRVB, that uses its own hydraulic system of oil flow and pressure as a power source to create a vacuum for recycling as well as an air blowing system for cleaning tracks. The oil goes through the pressure line to the hydraulic motor. The air blowing system and vacuum are built in one system that is always red and quick to use. There is an adjustable port built into the machine that a vacuum hose that attaches to it for manual work. The machine can be used for cleaning after events, vacuum cleaning roads, railways and construction sites. Eggersman The Eggersman company built a composting machine, the triangular windrow Turner Backhouse A38. It can be used for green waste composting or treating contaminated soil. The machine comes with three steel or rubber tracks that match the ground's levels. For asphalt areas, rubber pads are used, and for non-asphalt areas, double grouser steel shoes are used. It uses a diesel engine for high performance and low emissions. The space for the workers is ergonomically designed and is easy to use. It has a window width of up to 3.8 meters, a height of up to 1.9 meters, and a turning capacity of up to 1,500 meters cubed per hour. Car Mix The Car Mix 3500 TC is a newly designed, innovative, self loading concrete mixer with a double mixing propeller. It is a highly productive and reliable machine with its effective mixing unit and control without waste. It has a 600 litre blade and an output of 3.5 metres cubed. The blade is controlled by Joymix. It is a powerful and versatile machine with concentrates technology and design. A perfect mix is achieved by using a modern dosing control system called Concrete Mate. All these systems working together allow CarMix to produce high-quality concrete at a low cost. It lowers a scoop in the front of the machine to pick up the loose cement, gravel and sand. It then lifts it and opens the back end of the scoop to allow the materials to fall into the mixing tank where it is mixed with water to create the perfect concrete mix. The tank is turned around and deposits the concrete mixture. The system also prints a slip to show how much of each material was used for that load. Bex Machines The HS75ER is a hedge trimming machine developed by the Bex Machines Company. The machine doesn't emit emissions due to the hydraulic motors being replaced with 48 volt and 2 watt electric motors. It produces the same quality hedge trimming as regular hedge trimmers. The machine is made with high-quality materials as well as high-quality components. There is an arm that extends from the front of the vehicle to the side. Attached to the end of the arm is a bracket that blade is inside of. On the front end of the bracket is rubber pieces that protects the hedge and prevents the cut-off pieces from shooting out too far. The base of the bracket is curved to catch the cut-off pieces and lets them slide to the ground so not to cause any injury of the workers. Vermeer Vermeer created a machine for recycling and land clearing, the TG7000 tub grinder. The grinder is used to process wood waste quickly and effectively. The machine has 10 hammers and 20 double bolt cutter blocks. 
Various functions of the machine can be operated from a mobile loader due to its radio remote controls. The undermill conveyor system prevents clogging, which allows the machine to take in more materials at one time. There is a low-profile tub cover and rotor deflector, which reduces the quantity and distance of excess material that is thrown during the process. A claw hand part of the machine picks up the chunks of wood and deposits it into the top funnel of the machine where the cutting and hammering process begins. The wood is then broken down into a mulch-type material and deposited out of the machine via the conveyor system. Spar Power Machinery The Western Man WR870 is moss brush machine made to remove thick moss and small weeds. The wire brushes move in a clockwise and anti-clockwise rotation to reach into the small areas and remove the moss without having to use chemicals or water. The machine is driven by a belt that has a jockey wheel placed underneath the brush. This setup allows for the height of the brush bristles to be adjusted. This means that there can be harsh and gentle brushing done depending on the surface, although the harshness of the brushing will not cause damage to any concrete or paved areas. The bush head has a diameter of 870 mm and is interchangeable with other available brush types, like a poly brush for livestock areas and a poly wire mix for sensitive light moss covered areas. Mastenbrook The Mastenbrook 2015 Land Drainage Trencher is made for installing subsurface drainage pipes. It is a versatile machine for cross-country applications on various types of soil. Its design is compact and powerful, which provided efficient productivity. The method it uses for digging the trenches is a digging chain that has an adjustable speed. This digging chain has a lower speed with a higher torque. It uses GPS and has a manual override for grade control. The trench depth is from 0.4 meters to 2.5 meters and a width from 125 millimeters to 450 millimeters. It has an auger on both sides for neat soil discharge. The pipe is pivoted using hydraulic lifts and manual or hydraulic pipe reels. Alma Crawler the new Alma Crawler Telescopic Boom Lift, the Jibby 1670 Evo, is a self-propelled machine with a compact size with simple use and movements. This allows it to be used in small spaces. This machine has advanced technology installed on it to meet the user's needs in a range of applications. The machine can be driven with an individual joystick. The track undercarriage of the machine is offered in various widths from 1.35 metres to 2.45 metres. It can also be adjusted during travel. There are two types of baskets that can be attached. The standard size of 1.4 by 0.7 metres and the slightly larger size of 1.8 by 0.7 metres, both rotating at 70 degrees and can hold up to 230 kilograms. It has an outreach of 8.5 metres and a travel height of 9.8 metres. It has automatic levelling, enabling work to be done on uneven terrain. The workers are also protected if there is any unexpected impact due to the ultrasonic anti-collision system. Nimatech The Nimatech Hunkliner P12 Poffy Twist Clamp is a machine that is used to pick up and deposit bricks in a uniform manner. It was adjusted for the BKK elbow. The clamp is extended from an arm in front of the machine and is manoeuvred by the driver it pick up a specific amount and pattern of bricks and is then deposited in the correct way. This ensures that there is uniformity. It is efficient and more productive than the older ways of workers laying the bricks by hand. The machine is flexible which means it can pave smaller areas as well. Green Bull the Green Bull Straw and Vine Grinder was designed for the grinding of cattle manure, bald straw and hay. It can also be used for crushing of branches, bulrushes, pallets and vine shoots. It was designed with special hammers for the crushing process. It uses a hydraulic system and controls. A worker places the material in a cylinder where it is ground down to a finer material. Delandia the Delandia company designed a cantilever lift system that is mounted to the back of a truck using drawbar coupling. 
the lift is used for the loading of offloading of products from the trucks directly to the ground or to trailers. It is only used for medium capacity trucks and trailers, not more than 2,000 kilograms. It is a four-cylinder lift with either a reinforced steel platform or a lightweight aluminium platform. The platforms are only available up to 2,250 millimetres. There are various options available, such as with a drawbar for truck trailers, adaptions for tipper vehicles, lifts for trucks and short overhangs, or adaptations for mounting between the chassis beams. The orientation of the platform is adjustable and has an automatic ground level lift. There are rollers between the ground and the platform. Valair BH15 The Valair has a range of hydrostatic street sweepers, the Val Hydro range. The BH5 sweeper has a capacity of 5.5 metres cubed for waste, with a height of 3.05 metres, a width of 2.30 metres and a length of 6 metres. Its LP water pump has a capacity of 47 litres and its HP pump water pump has a capacity of 68 litres. It has a turbine capacity of 18,700 metres cubed per hour. The BH6 sweeper has a capacity of 6.5 metres cubed. It has the same height and width as the BH5, but the length is 6.64 metres. It has the same LP and HP water pump capacity as the BH5, but the turbine capacity is 25,000 metres cubed per hour. The BH9 sweeper has a capacity of 9.5 metres cubed. It has a height of 3.20 metres, a width of 2.5 metres and a length of 7 metres. Its LP water pump capacity is 47 litres and its various HP water pumps capacity from 68 litres to 200 litres with a turbine capacity of 35,000 litres cubed per hour. The BH14 sweeper has a capacity of 14.5 metres cubed. It has the same height and width as the BH9 but the length is 8.50 metres. The LP and HP water pump capacities are the same as the BH9, as well as the turbine capacity at 35,000 metres cubed per hour. Lastly, the BH15 has a capacity of 15.5 metres cubed. This machine's specifications are the same as the BH14 and the BH9, except for the length, which is 9.5 metres. <laughs>